Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology. And if you are on Windows 11, 23H2, you had KB5055629. So all you had to do, and this was the, of course, bug fixes, which are optional for the time being until they are mandatory for the uh, Windows updates for Patch Tuesday of May. So KB5055629 will appear, of course, in Windows Update. It will be a uh, update that you can install if you want. I always think that it's better to wait. There's been a lot of problems with some of the bug fixing updates. So uh, this arrived, of course, uh, and you've got a few things with, you know, File Explorer, Narrator. There's um, a phone link for some of you when you go in actually check the start menu phone link panel might now be something visible on the right side um, there's of course um, other little things including um, something that has to do with the way that icon uh, icons uh, are behaving on the uh, start menu but there are fixes and in those fixes in there you have um, the taskbar that is fixed. Um, if you use the arrow keys, uh, pressing Windows key and T, uh, the arrows move in the wrong direction for some uh, of you, like in different languages like Arabic and Hebrew. Uh, there's also uh, some um, issues that are fixed with Excel. There's sign-in impact, uh, fix an issue with the USB um, XHC controller and devices that uh, would um, be used on USB ports on Intel Core Ultra 200V. Uh, some fingerprint readers would not work. They also have updated the vulnerable driver block list file, like on Windows 10. Windows 10 had that. Uh, the driver uh, block list file was updated. And there's, of course, some Xbox um, things that have been fixed also. So basically, this is what happens if you have updated your computer to this uh, new update. Well, you get uh, the um, bill number of 22631.5262. And, uh, well, like I said, got no problems. You know, what we say is, is, you know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So you don't have to go there and you don't have to change anything. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.